We as human beings are deeply driven by our sense of identity. It's how we define ourselves and often how others define us. As creatives, our unique style serves as our artistic identity. It's what helps to define you as an artist. Speaking of identity, hi, my name is Gia Graham and I'm an illustrator, hand lettering artist and top teacher here on Skillshare. My creative identity or my creative style is rooted in the way I combine hand lettering with lush floral illustrations and well curated color palettes. The beauty of having a defined creative identity is that it's more than just a visual calling card. It can also help you build a thriving art brand. Once I developed a style of my own, my lettering and illustration career truly started to flourish. Clients and art directors began to seek me out because they thought my creative aesthetic would be perfect for their project or products. My artwork has appeared on a variety of products from greeting cards and apparel to book covers and even accessories. As most established artists will tell you, there's no magic formula for developing your style and consistent practice is the key. But when you're a beginner learning a new skill, it's sometimes difficult to know how to practice. As beginners, we often look to other artists for inspiration or mimic what we see, but that doesn't get us closer to tapping into our own style journey. Now this class will not give you a style, but we're going to take a very practical, beginner-friendly approach to style development, and I will show you how to practice your lettering in a logical and intentional way that will help you reach your goal of finding your own aesthetic. In the first half of this class, we will take stock of your visual influences and how you internalize them. Then, in the second half of the class, I will show you how to observe your influences with intention and how to explore and push your creativity so you can remix and reinterpret those influences rather than just mimicking them. Although the project will be lettering based, this class is not just for lettering artists. The principles can be applied to any creative focus, whether that's illustration, painting, or fine art. I will be working digitally on the iPad Pro using the Procreate app, but you're welcome to work in whatever medium you prefer. An iPad is not required for this class. Please note that although this is a beginner class, the focus will not be on lettering technique. If you're not familiar with hand lettering or the basics of Procreate, I recommend starting with my hand lettering in Procreate class. Now, if you're ready to set forth on the journey towards finding your style, let's take that first step. I'll see you in class.